Welcome to our EcoChurch platform video tutorial. This video will explore the following areas of the platform. Logging into your account, registering your account, registering a church, and joining a church team if your church is already registered. If you'd like help with just one of these areas, you can skip ahead to that point in the video. The time each section starts is listed in the video description below. If you prefer to receive help in a different format, with screenshots and descriptions explaining step-by-step step what you need to do, you can also look at our user guide. This is linked in the description below too. To get to the EcoChurch platform, go to the EcoChurch website at ecochurch.arosha.org.uk. You then need to click on the register slash login button in the top right corner. Logging in and registering. Here is the main homepage of the EcoChurch platform. You'll need to either register or log in with your own email address and chosen password to be able to access the content of the platform. Logging in. If you already have an account, focus on the right side of the page. You just need to type in the email address that you use to create your account, then type in your password and click login. You can also reset your password here if you need. See our user guide linked in the video description if you need support on how to do this. Registering. If you haven't created an account yet, you'll need to do so before being able to log in. To create your personal account, fill in the fields on the left side of the screen, provide your personal email address and create a memorable eight character password, which includes capital letters and numbers. If you want to receive communications by post, please provide your home address, not your church address. Please untick the box if you do not wish to receive communications by post. When you scroll down further, you'll reach the Keeping in Touch section. Please tell us which EcoChurch and Arosha UK updates you would like to receive by ticking all relevant checkboxes. We'd recommend signing up to EcoChurch Connect, our regular newsletter, which is full of helpful resources to encourage you along on your EcoChurch journey. You can then let us know how you heard about EcoChurch. Finally, click on the button Create New Account. An activation email will then be sent to you. You now need to go to your inbox and click on the link that has been sent to you. We recommend activating your account on a computer or laptop rather than a phone or tablet. If you can't find your activation email, check your spam folder. Once you've clicked on the link, you'll then be logged into the EcoChurch platform. Please make sure you choose the correct option when logging in and registering. If you already have an account, the following will happen if you try to register a new account under the same email address. It says the email address that I've tried to use is already taken. This message means that you have previously registered with your chosen email address on the EcoChurch platform. If you have forgotten your login details, click reset password and an email will be sent to your email address for you to reset your password. Once you have done this, you'll then be able to log into your account rather than trying to register again. Registering a church. So now you've created your account and logged in, you'll come to the main dashboard. You'll need to join the team for your church. If your church has already been registered on the EcoChurch platform, you'll need to find and join the church team. If your church hasn't yet been registered on the platform, you'll need to register it. Before looking to register your church, please check that it isn't already registered by performing a search using its postcode. If you find it is already registered, please follow the instructions in the next step of the video for joining a church if your church is already registered to avoid duplicate records. My fictional church for the purpose of this video is on Windmill Road in Brentford, where the Arusha UK office is. I'm going to type in the church's postcode here and press search. A list of registered churches local to the postcode you've entered in will appear. If your church isn't on the list, as mine isn't, Scroll down to the bottom of the page and press the Can't Find My Church button. Before you click I Can't Find My Church, do make sure that you have gone through and checked each of the church records that are already on the Eco Church platform to make sure that you're not duplicating the record for your church. You will then need to complete an online form to register your church. You need to provide the following information about the church, the full church name and the full postal address as well as denomination, 
number of regular worshippers, whether your church is urban or rural, the year the church was physically built, as well as if you meet in your own building and if your building is listed. I've now filled in information for my fictional church. If your church doesn't have a building, please use the address of the location where you usually meet, for example, in a school hall or another community building. After completing all the fields, click the Register Church button. We have now registered our church. You'll be returned to your dashboard and your church will be listed in the Your Church section. At the moment, I'm the only person on the team, but I could ask others to sign up to and work on the survey together. They would need to create their accounts and join the church team as we show in the next step. Joining a church. To join a church that is already registered on the Eco Church platform, press the register slash join a church button on the right side of your dashboard. This will lead you to a search page where you can enter your church's postcode. I'll enter the postcode of my fictional church at the Arusha UK office and press search. A list of churches local to that postcode will be produced. If your church is already registered, it will be on this list. Here I can find my fictional church. Click the Select This Church button under the correct church address. This will lead to a confirmation page. Please check the details to make sure you're joining the right church. If this is your church, click on the Join This Church button. You'll then be returned to your dashboard and your church will now be listed in the Your Church section. <laughs>